Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Cyber Munib. Today we will discuss how to add tables in the latex. This is the fourth part of the tutorial video. So if you have not watched previous parts, uh, you can I'll add the link in the description. Today we will cover how to add the table, how to do centering of the table, how to align the table on the page, how to add caption for the table, how to remove overlapping text in the table, and how to add horizontal and vertical lines in the table. So let's proceed. First of all, you need to uh, in your code. You need to say begin table. So within the table, you need to add the tabulars. You can say begin tabular, and then within the tabular here, uh, you should add how much number of columns you want. Let's say I want two columns C from C, and within uh, the tabular, you can add the columns like tab one. So this will be the first row, first column. And if I want to go to the second column, I need to add and tab 2. And if I want a second row, let's say I'll move to the next line and tab 3 and tab 4. So this is the table we have just created. In order to add the caption in the table, we should use caption before tabular. Caption of the table. So this is the caption over here. If I want to get the table within the center uh, before that, let's say I want a vertical lines across this. I'll use this. This will add the vertical lines across my table. If I want horizontal lines, I should use H line within my code. H line. H line. So this is uh, my table is like around a box at the moment. If I want another H line over here, I should use like this. So this will be completely in the form of table that we normally use. But if I want to do a centering, like make the table uh, position in the center, I should do centering, but before tabular, centering. This will align the table in the center. Furthermore, if I want, like currently my table is at the top of the page, I want it at the bottom, I want it uh, right after the text, I should be using B for the bottom. like my table is at the bottom of the page now if I want to use it right after the text like right after this text so it's right after this text so uh, similarly if I uh, if my table is overlapping uh, some you can say text like my table is uh, currently I'm using double column format and and my table is overlapping the second uh, column of the text then I should be using instead of table I should use table star this will um, my, you can say expand the table to the complete page let's say over here so no text will overlap this table now so that's all for today's video thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye bye